What's a definition essay? A definition essay is a type of academic paper that explains the meaning of a term or a concept. Some terms usually have concrete exact meanings, for example, a book, planet, or tree. Other terms, such as honesty, anger, and honor, are abstract, and their explanations depend on a person's point of view. Therefore, this essay can have two approaches depending on the subject of discussion. First, you can define a term with the exact meaning and from your point of view. While the definition of the term may change, the structure of the essay remains the same, with an introduction, body, and conclusion just as explicatory, cause and effect essays, what's the definition essay writing help? Definition essay writing help is a service that we offer to aid students to deal with essay writing issues. We aid students in writing a quality definition essay, choosing good topics, structuring, proofreading, referencing, and editing for them. So, you can approach us if you need help writing an essay from scratch, need proofreading and editing services, or even choose a topic and create an outline. Feel free to contact us at any time of the day. What's the purpose of a definition essay? The definition essay aims to resolve the controversy on the meaning of a term. The essay defines the term in many ways but brings out the clear and actual meaning rather than what people imply. Through various illustrations, it presents a full picture of different usages of the term as a noun, verb, or adjective making the reader aware of the contextual explanations. Examples of definition essay topics you can write on, below are some good definition essay topics you can write about, such as, business intelligence, what's cybercrime, cultural appropriation, define democracy, what's climate change, what is a cold war, define the concept of grief, what is maturity, what is physical fitness, you can still have longer essay topics such as, the secrets of the happiest man in the world, why do families break up, what it means to be a single parent, what's a Law Estate, the freedom that was taken away from us during the COVID-19 pandemic, first day at work, if you have one of those slow days and got such definitions essay topics above, relax. Our professionals will present an impressive definition essay if you buy our papers, extended definitions essay topics, these are essays that deal with broad terms. However, terms with only one meaning can serve a purpose in these topics, the many faces of generosity, what feminism isn't, how to be rich. Best tips for writing definition essays from our experts. Before writing a definition essay, you should consider the following pro tips. 1. Pick the right term. To write a quality essay, you must choose the right discussion word. Like in other essays, such as a college application, problem and solution, choosing a good topic or term you are familiar with helps you write a good essay. So, while choosing the definition term, consider the following, term with complex meaning the simple word won't give you more writing content than a complex one. For instance, choosing between writing and pencil. Writing is a complex term, thus easy to get more details than a pencil which is a concrete word. Disputable word means different things for different people, so you get an essay analysis. Choose a multidimensional term, like beauty and not desk. Choose a word you are familiar with, so that as you elaborate, you can be sure that your definition fits the word. Read the dictionary's definition. Get to know the official meaning of the word from the dictionary and compare it with what you know. Research the word's origin, the sources of the word. For instance, the Oxford English Dictionary will offer the history behind the word, which can give you more insights, too. Create a rough draft of the essay, start preparing to write the essay by noting down various ideas that you have on the term. You can handle this stage in the following ways, write an analysis, separate the word into sections, analyze and define each part in separate paragraphs. However, this technique only works for words with multiple parts, such as return and friendship, return, friendship, classify the term, check which parts of speech your term belongs to according to a standard definition in a dictionary. This information will be helpful as you write your essay. The explanations below match the details you should include in the definition essay in this article. Make a comparison of the unfamiliar term to something familiar. This technique will help your readers to understand the term better if it seems strange to many. Give the history of the term, origin, explain the features of the traditional thoughts associated with the word, use examples for illustration, use a relevant story or image relating to the term in explaining an abstract or formless concept. 
For example, when explaining kindness and justice, use negotiation in explanation, negation, four terms you feel are often misunderstood by people, it's best to mention what it's not as an effective way of making your audience understand, give background information, research the words etymology, where it originated and how the current meaning evolved, three. Organize the details, check over the list of ideas you have gathered and organize them in a certain pattern. For example, if using narration in your essay, then let the ideas follow a chronological order, and if using features, then start with the most to the least or least to the most order. 4. Incorporate literal devices you know can apply to your definition to make the essay interesting. 5. Keep your sentences simple and clear. However, sometimes you may need longer descriptive sentences, so mix them well. 6. Revise and edit your essay, proofread it, check for any grammar issues, and correct them accordingly. After going through the above steps and making some notes, it's now moment to create your essay outline. If any of the above procedures seem confusing, always consult us. Again, you don't have to struggle to write this essay, we have affordable definition essay help. Definition essay outline, use the following definition essay outline in writing your essay. Remember, your essay should include an introduction with a thesis, body, and conclusion. Introduction 1. First, you need to create a hook in the first line, create a catchy hook. Some definitions may be boring or too obvious for the reader, such as love and friendship, since others may have discussed them. So, to ensure your essay doesn't become boring to the reader, then form a good hook with the following features, be in the first sentence of the introduction, relevant to the topic, interesting or unexpected, creative, connect with the message in the introduction, some examples of hook statements that you can use include statistical facts or curious information, current quote on the topic, real-life example, rhetorical question to the phrase, too. Include a traditional or dictionary definition of the term to have a basis for your definition. 3. Open with a contradictory image to what would be your image in illustrating the definition. 4. Form a thesis, state how you define the term, body, history paragraph, background information, give some background about the term or your connection to the term. It may be historical or your story concerning the term, second paragraph, the first part of your definition for the term, illustration example, and analysis of the example, third paragraph, the second part definition of the term. Illustration examples and analysis of the example, fourth paragraph, third definition, illustration examples and analysis of the example, and b, the second and third paragraphs are optional as it depends on whether your word has two parts. If your word is one, you will have a three-paragraph body, the second paragraph should be a denotive definition. The definition in this paragraph should depend on the dictionary meaning of the term. You can explain how to use the term in writing and conversation, for example, as a noun, verb, or adjective, where applicable. The third paragraph should be connotative, giving your definition of the word. It's the implied meaning of the word based on your research or personal experience. Give examples of the word in action, and remember to keep your readers engaged. In summary, this paragraph should communicate your understanding of the concept or term. There are more ways of organizing your paper in this article that you can consider, especially in the body. Conclusion, give a review of the definition's main points, make a reference to the introduction hook as a way of unifying the whole essay. You may close with an explanation of how the definition has affected you. Would you like to present such an organized, quality essay? Then, engage our experts in writing your essay, they won't disappoint.